Hey guys, uh, my name is Steven and today I'm going to show you uh, my run through of Mortimer. So I looked on YouTube and I didn't see uh, anyone get through Mortimer. So I decided, you know, I might as well put, make a video and uh, show everyone how I'm going to do it. Right? So what you want to do is you want to use all the kind of boosters that you have. You don't want to be worrying about um, your health during the fight. So uh, this at this time, you know, you basically just use all your boosters. Um, I'm not going to show you my team first. So my team is actually complete shit. Uh, this was a long time ago, so, uh, you know, I noticed that I have no Zodiac matching. Basically, I have one PE super, two epics, that one that's not even maxed. But uh, an important thing I, I do have is a swap. And a swap is really good because you can get easier uh, five gem matches, which will be useful when you're fighting multiple mobs. Uh, during Mortimer. So, um, with that, I'm actually going to use, uh, you know, some of the boosters that I have. Um, in this video, I use a water booster and a recovery booster, but you also want to use the health booster if you have one. So, and uh, I'm about to start right here. So, a couple things to know about the fight is that um, you obviously always want to keep an eye on your health, but the main point is you want to get these five gem matches, right? And uh, essentially, that's basically going to be doing all the damage onto the mobs. If you have uh, lacerate mobs, or you got you got blast or crush or whatever, um, you know those can help. But mainly, you just want to get these five gen swaps to do the most damage in the least amount of time. Um, so, uh, other things to note about this fight is that it's a it's like five minutes. Uh, you only have five minutes to basically go through five different sets of mobs, right? So. Um, Essentially, you want to do this again as quickly as possible, and um, also keep yourself alive. So uh, that's the general gist of it.
All right, that's it. That's how you beat Mortimer. I finished with six seconds left, so it was a little close, but um, that's it. That's how you do it. All right, um, I'm going to continue this video a little just to see. I've never, uh, never gotten past this far, so I'm just going to go ahead and check out Lost Temple. Also, so a couple things to note from that fight. Essentially, uh, you can beat Mortimer with not a great team. So the recommended PR was like 200,000, but I beat Mortimer with 150,000 uh, PR without a great team. Uh, just the most important thing is just skip the five gem swaps. Try to do it as, as quickly as possible. Use your boosters. Uh, not finish before the five minutes are up. You can use gold to extend the time. I think it's also by another five minutes, but uh, the amount of gold you have to spend increases based on... Uh, how many times you've used the gold to, to extend your time, so I would generally not try to use it. Alright. Alright, okay. That's it. This is Lost Temple. I, I haven't ever seen this, but that's it. Um, I have to wait until uh, my troop starts this uh, Mortimer before we can do anything, but nope, oh, that's it. Thanks for watching.